Microsoft Word 2013. The Ribbon. Microsoft Word has several ribbons running across the top of the screen, providing users with an organized list of command buttons. Ribbons are displayed by clicking on one of the ribbon tabs located across the top of the screen. The default tab, which has the most commonly used features of Word, is called Home. The ribbons are broken down into groups. On the Home tab, we have a clipboard group, a font group, a paragraph group, as well as styles and editing. The Home ribbon has the Getting Started type buttons that you'll need as you're working on your document. You will have to move to a different ribbon to find what you're looking for. For instance, the Insert ribbon has options for inserting items or objects into your Word document. We have a Pages group, Tables. Here we can insert illustrations, use Apps for Office, insert media or links, comments, headers and footers, specialized text, as well as symbols. The Design tab allows you to change the document's theme, some global formatting choices, things like colors, fonts, different effects, and the page background. Page Layout allows us to change the page setup, from margins to orientation, size, columns, things like that, our paragraph options, like indent and spacing, as well as how to arrange or align things in our document. References allows us to easily add a table of contents, insert footnotes or endnotes, choose a style for citations and bibliography, insert captions, even cross-reference them, index, as well as table of authorities. The Mailings tab allows us to create envelopes and labels, and easily start a mail merge. As we start the mail merge, the Write and Insert fields, Preview Results, and Finish options will become active. The Review tab allows us to finish up, as in proofing, language choices, comments, we can do track changes, accept or reject those changes, compare two different documents, even protect by restricting editing. The View tab allows us to change the view of our document from reading mode, print layout, or web layout. We can show or hide the ruler, grid lines, or navigation pane. We have some zoom options, how the windows are arranged. We can even access macros from here. And that is the ribbon in Microsoft Word 2013.